So guys, one stuff is cheap. Back with you on a GT5 online video today. Yes, guys, I'm going to show you, yes, the only working solo merge glitch that is working right now in GT5 online, everybody. Uh, so before this video, I'd like to like, to subscribe, to the notifications on if you want to see any more GT5 online videos. Make sure you go and check out all my socials, everybody, linked down in the description below. My, um, my Instagram, my TikTok, all that sort of stuff, linked down in the description below. Just want to say, everybody, yeah, <clears throat> it's been a while since I posted a video. I know I'm very slack on posting videos, everybody. I really sort of apologize about that. Um, so, yeah. All right. So let's get into this video. So what do you want to do, everybody, is you want to start up the job. All right. You want to start up the uh, ECU job. Okay. Just go ahead and start it up. So just let everybody know. I heard a couple of people had, like, I did explain the video last time incorrectly so what you want to do everybody is you just want to go ahead and start up the job and you're saying does it have to be the ecu job i think so because you start at this contract mission part right here now okay if you don't have to let me know everybody all right just let me know on that so what you want to do everybody you just want to go ahead and make your way to your eclipse towers was over here okay so i did skip the video until there but from here you just want to go ahead and just literally drive to your Eclipse Towers. Okay, so I'm going to show you what to do when you get to Eclipse Towers. So if you have any problems in your queries, let me know in the comment section below, everybody. As well, all the people will help you as well in the comment section below. You can also join my Discord as well, everybody, if you want any more, you know, um, help and stuff like that. All right. So just go ahead and make your way to the Eclipse Towers. You want to pull up your interaction menu. You want to hover over support crew. Okay. You want to go up to the door. And once you go up to the door, what do you want to do is you just want to go and <clears throat> you just want to go and press quick fix. All right. Press support crew, quick fix. you be on this menu. Then you just want to press B. Then from here, you should be able to see the quick fix on your map okay so i'm going to press pause all right so i'm going to see is the quick fix there so the quick fix is there you see the wii icon there it is right there so from here what you want to do is you want to go ahead <clears throat> you want to go ahead into your eclipse towers all right and you want to uh basically i will have all of the cars that you're able to do this uh linked down in the pin comments okay the comments won't be the pin comment though okay so what you want to do is you want to go in to the eclipse towers or any of uh, any of the garages so what you want to do is you want to go and select a card that you're able to do this on so i'm going to select this one this one you're able to do it so what you want to do is you want to pull it up or pull it outside to the workshop or that works garage all right you want to pull it out um, once you pull it out what do you want to do from here you want to go ahead and make your way over to the quick fix section all right so i'm just going to go out what do you want to do from here is you want to go and shoot the window once you shoot the window you want to go back in once you go back in what do you want to do is you want to go ahead and go up to the quick fix so you basically just destroy something on the car it can be the windows it can be anything just put a dent on the car and then just put it over the quick fix and as you can see it is now merged now so you basically just keep merging different components on these cars so what do you want to do is you want to pull it into the garage once again so i don't know what difference it made from the merge i think it give underglow it might have get lights i don't know i might have just added on a a couple of stuff so what you want to do is go on and go on to the next car and just keep doing it over and over and over again just do the same thing again so you just want to go ahead and drive out the next car just go ahead and drive it out and um, what you want to do is just one just destroy just put something on uh, like a dent on the car so i'm just going to drive it out right here so you just want to simply just get out of the vehicle and just put some damage on it and then just drive it up the quick fix and do the whole thing over and over and over again. All right. So basically, it's very, very straightforward, everybody. But I'm just going to show you what components changed on this. So I believe on this one, it did have a wee spoiler in the back of it. And I believe there was a couple of other things added to it as well. But I believe that the lights were the same before it was modded. Um, all right. So just want to go on do it on the next car. Just pull it out and do the same thing. Just drive it up to the quick fix, get out and destroy something on it. And then, yeah, so that is it, everybody. Fairly straightforward glitch. I hope to see you guys for another video. Subscribe, hit that like button with the burning guns because this guy's going to stay tough. 
Um, no soul emerge glitch yeah everybody but there is a merge glitch that's working right now you need two people for it but uh yeah hope you guys for another video and peace and see you in the next video